Continuing on the custom car review streak, we're going to be talking about a Dokkan Fest Super Kaioken Goku, and it's coming in from Eden. I'm calling you Eden because I don't know how to say the first part of your name, so I hope that's fine. Uh, and uh, I think that's about it from the intro. Send me custom cards over to vhfcustomcards.gmail.com to get your custom card as soon as possible. I'm getting all of these recent custom cards out of the way, and consider subscribing to the channel because I do double uploads every day. Hey, if you enjoy the content, consider subscribing. Um, so with that out the way, let's see what Eden has to say. So Eden says, I've been a fan for a while. Shout out to you, brother. You've been keeping up with me for a while. Shout out to all the people that watch me consistently and just are just a supporter of me. You guys are absolutely amazing. And you guys know I love all of you. And I finally decided to send a card in. Hope you like it. And in parentheses, hope you're doing well, by the way. I'm going to love the card, and I am doing quite well. Hope you're doing good yourself, brother. Anyway, let's see what we're looking at here. So, Burning Bright in the other world. He is Super Int. Super Saiyan Kaioken Goku Angel. W, just card art. This is pretty W. Uh, and the art is by RV910. So, shout out to the person that created this art. And his leader skill is Full Power, Accelerated Battle, or Other World Warriors 3 key and 170% across the board. And the 30% of the stats slash 200% of the leader skill is going to be two Super Saiyans or Final Trump card. Now, I'm not going to lie to you guys. This leader skill is not too crazy. There are a bunch of old, aged out units that badly need an easy A. Uh, now, granted, there are great options like this new Gohan. You do have the Gammas. You have this uh, the LR Dragon Ball Super Broly, which you could pair up right, right next to Tech Broly. Could you? Could you make something happen with these two? Um, you also have Dragon Fist. You could still get some shenanigans out with God Goku. And uh, you also have Kefla. You got Super Vegeta for some shenanigans too. As well as you also having... I saw a Super Easy A here somewhere. Yeah, the Super Easy A Dragon Fist Goku. Um, yeah, this category is not too crazy. There's only a select handful of good units. Yeah. Yeah, this, this category is not that crazy. But I like to assume that the card is pretty good. Uh, so his stats are as shown for all my stat junkies. His defense, quite high. Yeah. That's a norm on these custom car views, by the way. Even their defense, either their defense is quite high or their overall stats are high. <laughs> and it makes sense because we're in a defensive age for Dokkan, so, you know, can't really say too much there. So, his passive, Red Hot Blazing Battle, 3 key into 100% attack and defense at the start of turn, and he also gets 160% attack and defense performing a super attack. Nice. And he also gets an additional 200% attack and defense. And he also gets an additional 20% chance to dodge as the first and second attack in a turn. I do like that. And he also just has a baseline 50% chance to dodge. Cool. And he launches two additional attacks that both have a 70% chance to come with super attack. Nice. And he also gets 10% damage reduction up to 40% per rainbow keys are obtained. Okay. And he also gives full power, accelerated battle, or other world warriors two key and 35% attack and defense. Two key and 35% attack and defense to full power, accelerated battle, and other world warriors. Okay, so he's supporting his categories that he leads. Yeah, I do like that. Okay, what's his super attack effect? So his super attack effect, that being the super Kyle Ken Kamehameha. This guy needs a Dokkan as bad. Absolutely. He is very deserving. Um, and other world warriors, come on out. Like, it needs help. Let's just go ahead and take a quick uh, peek over at other world warriors. Where is this Super Saiyan Kyle Ken Goku? Other World Warriors badly needs help. It's in the trenches. It's like GT Boss's level of trenches. Where is Other World Warriors? There it is. Is it one of the worst categories in Dokkan? I mean, you do have... Uh, you got AGL Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Surely he's great. Uh, who else? Who else do we have here? Is that it? Wow. Yo, this category is terrible. I mean, AGL Pycon, when he does get his easy A. Cool. Yeah, when he gets his easy A. Uh, yo, this category is ass. Why do you not have an easy A? You badly need an easy A. Let me tell you guys something. When this guy easy A's, like, AJ Pycon, when he gets his easy A, he better not easy A before this guy does. That would be crazy. But yeah, the point is that this category is in the trenches. It's like GT Boss's level of trenches. Just terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Is it crazy to say that this category is similar in a way to GT bosses where it has a great leader, but the rest of the category is dying around them. I, I just thought about that just now. This category is comparable to GT bosses because 
the the leader is great for the team. I mean, Omega, Omega's, it's like Omega is, Omega's good on GT bosses, but the rest of the team dies around him, right? Doesn't Omega get crazy amounts of damage reduction? Doesn't he have like a little revive? I think I haven't used Omega in a minute. Um, I'm pretty sure like Omega is like great on the team, but like the rest of the team dies around him. I haven't used Omega in a while. I do have Omega, but I haven't used them in a quite a long time. But yeah, I think it's similar to a case where like the leader is good, but like he's the leader survived, but the rest of the team is dying around. That's similar to that case. But anyways, I have accelerated battle pulled up because this card wants rainbow orbs oh by the way let me just yeah 50 percent attack at one turn does immense damage to the enemy and guarantee crits um uh, okay so the super attack effects are amazing okay so uh and the active skill i gotta go off on a tangent for a second after i'm done reading this card active skill uh time to go all out condition can be activated when hp is 60 percent or more so from the third turn of battle so very easy to get out and he gets five key and 70 percent attack at defense one turn so you could either pop this immediately or just pop this around the end of the battle or pop this to save you to go ahead and just blitz the boss in offensive fashion or to go ahead and tank like but mostly actually no he could it's like wow he can really get up to 40 percent damage reduction a 70 percent chance to dodge he gets a lot of stats from his passive 200 percent attack and defense right over here 160 percent attack and defense right over here when performing a super attack as well as 50 percent attack and defense for one turn on a super attack effect so he's getting an attack defensive from his pass to a super attack effect very nice he just gets free stats for being inside the second or or first slot as well as additional dodge chance building up to a 70 percent chance to dodge as well as two additional super attack chances that's just unrestricted that's great 40% damage reduction, I'm pretty sure I already said that, as well as support, that's, that's pretty good, and he just gets free key and stats for one turn when he pops his active skill, and it's very easy to get out, so easy condition for his active skill, as well as great active skill, just free stats and key for that one turn, he gets uh, up to a 70% chance to dodge, lots of stats, additional super attack chances, up to 40% damage reduction if he gets four rainbow key spheres, supporting, I mean, this card speaks for itself, I mean, this, this card talks to you this card is great it's a, it's a great card um but oh yeah let me just go ahead and read out the links and the categories before i go on a, a quick little tangent so links are prepare for battle shock speed super saiyan common ha over in the flash other world warriors and fierce battle so great link set in terms of key like wow prepare for battle shock speed and over in the flash yeah so like over in the flash for some like these fusion characters as well as shocking speed for some of these i don't know there's some villains that have shocking speed so for whatever reason if you want to go ahead and throw a villain with this guy on full power you could i'm pretty certain that you have shocking speed i'm pretty certain you have shocking speed i think but yeah there are some villains you could throw this guy with to get shocking speed activated with him so he has a great link set and also he's on pure saiyans goku's family super saiyans kamehameha full power final trump card bond a parent child bond of friendship turtle school tournament participants earth red fighters other world warriors and accelerated battle now a quick thing i wanted to say right so uh this card already has a great defensive ability to fall back on that being a 50 percent chance to dodge lovely right and he also gets free stats a, a high amount of stats and additional dodge chance when he's inside the first or second slot so he can get up to a 70 percent chance to dodge with an additional 200 percent attack and defense which is obviously great but one thing is right this guy wants to collect rainbow orbs if he doesn't dodge to be able to withstand attacks that he could take um now here's one thing that i noticed and I don't, i'm pretty certain that are there any are there any rainbow orb changers that are on his 200 percent leader skill i think i'm glancing you yeah you but are we could we could we like could we run him is this guy good enough to run this guy can't take normals unless he gets key spheres for that damage reduction he wants rainbow key spheres himself doesn't he we're not running this guy why would we run this guy and like uh, lower level difficult content if that makes sense we're running him but in higher levels hell no no we're not running this guy so one thing i noticed guys while looking through accelerated battle and here's the reason why i have this up so 
I went on over to uh, the Dokkan Wiki. Of course, shout out to the Dokkan Wiki uh, because I use this website almost every day. Uh, guys, if not every day, excuse me. I pretty much do because I'm recording on this website and I'm always using it as like a little reference when I'm actually playing Dokkan. Um, what do you guys notice, class? One thing that you, you notice. You take a look at Super Physical for LRs. Why isn't the ninth year Blue Gogeta on Accelerated Battle? Is, is Gogeta not... Is he not fighting... Is He's not whooping Broly's ass fast. Is he not fighting fast? Is that not a fast fusion? In his super attack animations, is he not moving quick when he does that little he's literally break dancing on the boss like doing a little spin kicks isn't that for his like is that for his 12 key or his 18 key he's bro and then don't get me started on his 12 key for his uh, for his post transformation when he goes into blue where he's literally boxing the boss up he's literally <laughs> i uh, huh um Am I crazy? Uh, yeah. Gogeta. Vegito's on here, though! <laughs> You're gonna tell me... It's like, sure, Vegito's fine. The fifth year anniversary, Vegito is on here. But Gogeta is not? Uh, I, I, what is it? What's the definition on the Dokkan Wiki? Consists of characters that displayed an astounding speed. Is this guy not moving fast? Literally, in the in the fifth year anniversary, Blue Gogeta's, um, in his, what's that, in his 18 key? I think it's his 18 key. He's, is he not, he's, doesn't he zip into the air, fly to, he flies towards the enemy at Mach 30 speed. Oh, oh. <laughs> you know what? Cool, and the reason why I was thinking about that guy is because his rainbow orb changing could actually help this guy. It could. To give him his damn damage reduction per rainbow keys are obtained. Blue Gogeta would be an amazing linking partner for this guy, no? No, he wouldn't. He, he wouldn't, no, because he definitely would get Super Saiyan. He definitely would get Kamehameha. I'm pretty certain he would. And... He would also... Is, does he have Kamehameha? I don't remember. Uh, He would also be on, let's just say, Accelerated Battle. Okay. Is he on full power? I don't even remember. We're not even going to check. But he would... It's like if he had Accelerated Battle, he is on Final Trump card. And he's on Super Saiyans. Right? Certainly enough, this, this brother is on Super Saiyans. Okay. All right. Unless I'm going crazy here. I must be going crazy. Um, So W card. Um, I don't have much more to say here. Uh, I mean, great link set, a plethora of category teams that he's on, um, good super attack effect, guarantee crits, 50% attack if it's one turn, he also gets an attack and defensive buff in his passive on super as well as getting it, um, in his super attack effect, obviously great, he gets up to a 70% chance to dodge, 40% damage reduction, lots of stats, additional super attack chances, as well as supporting all three of the categories that he leads, all right good card is there any flaws about this card if you if you was to nick pit this card um the leader skill is not that great for his 200 that's it yeah and maybe if i think it'd be pretty busted if he orb changed would it be pretty busted if he was a rainbow orb changer it probably would because he'd be easily able to get his 40 percent damage reduction who gives a damn like it's custom cards right <laughs> but yeah i appreciate you guys for watching you guys are the best eden w card um, thank you for sending in your card, brother. Uh, send me custom cards over to VHFCustomCards at gmail.com so I get to your custom card as soon as possible. While I'm getting all of these recent custom cards out the way, subscribe if you enjoy the video, guys. We're trying to, hey, we're trying to move on up. <laughs> Peace.